Okay, today we want to talk about how electronic speedos work and how to set up your own test bench at home. What I've done is I've got an electric drill, the vehicle speed sensor with three wires coming out of it, held in a vise, and got a speedo head. What you need to do is on the back of the speedo, on this one it's got ground written on one wire, ignition written on one wire, and speed sense written on the other wire. If you look at this diagram here, you got ground, ignition, which is your 12 volts, and the sense wire. Here's your battery, here's your speed sensor. I took an electric drill, covered it in tape, put it on the gear, held it in a vise, wired it correctly, and then here, I spin it up like this. I also cast my eye down on the odometer at the bottom and make sure that that's turning. What happened with the last odometer uh, was, was that the odometer was turning but the speedo needle wouldn't rise and I immediately thought I wired it wrong but it wasn't actually, it was faulty in the head unit. So I went and got another one. So if you're, if you're struggling fixing your own speedo or you're or you don't know if it's the speed sensor that's faulty, the speedo head that's faulty, uh, take a moment and just set up a test bench for the battery, get your speed sensor, get your head, get your 12 volts, get your wiring, and go get them and win like we just did.